Good morning everyone. So welcome back into our class. So for today's lesson is all about converting fractions. So do you remember our improper fractions and mixed fractions? So let's try to convert this too. But before that, let's try to look at these vocabularies. First, we have improper fraction improper fraction to mixed fraction mixed fraction three equal equal four add add then five multiply multiply so in this topic, we try to convert improper fraction to mixed fraction and mixed fraction to improper fraction. How are we going to convert this? Maybe you have these questions too in your minds. So are you ready? Let's try to look at this. First, let's try to convert mixed fraction to improper fraction so in mixed fraction we need to multiply and add so like for example we have here 3 and 4 6 so the first step we need to multiply our whole number to our denominator so we have 3 times 6 that is equivalent to 18. Then, we have to add 4 our numerator. So, 18 plus 4, that is equivalent to, what do you think? So, that is equivalent to 22. Then, we can just carry our denominator. 2, we have 6 and one fourth. So first step, we need to multiply the whole number to our denominator. So 6 times 4, that is equivalent to 24. Then we add 1, our numerator. So 24 plus 1, that is equivalent to 25. So 25 would be our numerator. Then we carry our denominator, which is 4. So the improper fraction of 6 and 1 fourth is 25 over 4. How about this one? We have 9 and 6 fourth. So we multiply 9 times 4. That is equivalent to 36 plus 6. That is equivalent to 42. Then we carry our denominator. So what would be our answer? This 42 over 4. What if we're dealing to improper fraction to mixed fraction? So the mathematical operation to be used would be division here. So like for example, we have 11 over 2. So we need to divide 11 divided by 2. So what would be our answer? That would be 5. So 5 would be our whole number. Then we multiply 5 times 2, that would be equal to 10. Then subtract 11 minus 10, that would be equal to 1. So 1 would be our remainder. So our remainder, which is 1, would become our numerator. Then we can just carry our denominator, which is 2. So the mixed fraction of 11 over 5 is 5 and 1 half. How about 18 over 4? So we need to 
divide 18 divided by 4. So 18 divided by 4, that is equivalent to 4. So 4 would be our whole number. Then 4 times 4, that is equivalent to 16. Then we need to deduct 18 minus 16, that is equivalent to 2. So, what is our numerator? Our remainder. Very good. So, we put 2 there in our numerator. Then, we can just carry our denominator, which is 4. So, what is the mixed fraction of 18 over 4? We have 4 and 2 fourths. Getting it? I hope so. So that would be our lesson for today, converting improper fraction to mixed fraction and mixed fraction to improper fraction. So see you again in our next video.